big gap on the scoreboard. The second half begins with very different goals for these teams. One side trying to mount a comeback, one side trying to protect their lead. We've got Zion Williamson, Marcus Smart out there with Jordan Poole. Then there's Kawhi Leonard. Not himself from range right now, but the only way out of this funk is to keep trying. And for the Kings, Fox runs point with Herter by his side. Trey Lyles is out there with Harrison Barnes. And it's Sabonis in at the center position. Poole's shot is off. Herter against Smart. Sabonis outside. And so he draws the foul, headed to the line to shoot a pair. Can't afford to be too handsy with Sabonis. He's very good at forcing the issue and getting these calls. Hardaway's checked in for Boston. And he can't hit the second. Boston on offense. The biggest lead of the game, 15 points. Knocks it loose. Pass to Leonard. This one for three. He can't get it to go. So Sacramento will take it the other way. It's Barnes on the wing. Defended by Hardaway. Here's Fox. And he was fouled while in the act of shooting. So he'll take two free throws. It'll be on Zion Williamson. Boy, I like the focus and unselfishness Fox brings to the court. A strong defender with lightning quick reflexes in every spot. Poole, he's checked in for Boston. And guess what, guys? I mean, one of the ways De'Aaron Fox improved his skills growing up was playing 2K, learning the NBA game on 2K. I love it. They're at the limit already. That, to me, is just lazy defense. Ninety seconds into the second half now. Here's Sabonis. And rejected! Smart for three. Let's it go from deep. And they get it back. Leonard for three. They get the rebound. Oh! oh what a hammer! This kind of six slam is just one of the reasons this team is in charge of this game right now, VA. You know, this an edge the way they play, and a confidence they're not afraid to show. Boy, and I used to love going up and jamming it down like that guy. Holmes, he's checked in for Sacramento. Merrill comes in for Barnes. Smart against Fox. It's deflected. Here's Leonard, and buries the jumper to finish off the break. And Boston leads by 16. That may not be his first choice, but Kawhi's not going to pass it up if it's there for him. Good decision to take the quick jumper off the catch. Herter finds Holmes. Yep, that one goes. Holmes has got his first points in this one. If you give him any sort of space, he's going to attack. And Boston calls time here. Baysmore's checked in for Merrill. Boston on offense. Here's Doliak, and he goes in for the dunk. He just rises up and throws it down hard with one hand. That is such a go-to move for him. He holds nothing back on those. Does it as well as anybody, fellas. Tremendous skill while in the air. Now here's Holmes. He's guarded closely. It's blocked. Here's Leonard. The shot won't fall. Ooh, some solid defense from Herder. We've got 155 left to play in the third quarter. Holmes, good. You have to love the unselfishness on display there. Excellent pass. Here's Leonard. And the dunk by Leonard. Boy, a wicked dunk by Leonard, showing this defense just how explosive he can be. And it's Sacramento's ball. It's a 16-point game. Outside Herder. And a foul called on the way up. 
So he'll take two from the free-throw line. And good whistle there. Yeah, you can hear the smack all the way over here where we are. Giddy's checked in for pool. Pass to Smart. Now Leonard from deep. Rebounded by Lyles. And he almost made them regret defending him so loosely. Now here's Davis. And the layup is good off the glass. Davis has got five now. Simple. The closer you are to the hoop, the better your chance to score. Can you say immediate entry into the highlight reel? Woo, what a dunk, PA. <laughs> it's showtime now, man. They've built up a lead, and they're starting to rub it in. And why not? A little salt in the wound. The more plays they make like that, the more they'll have these guys reeling and on the ropes. Davis from long range. And they recover it. And out of bounds. Boston will have it. Barnes, he's checked in for Sacramento. Substitution for the away team. Harrison Barnes. 44 seconds left in the third. Smart for three. And so the ball out of bounds. Smart touches it last. Thompson, he's checked in for Boston. Hardaway comes in for Smart. Lenz checked in for Sacramento. 36 seconds left in the third quarter. Knocked away. Barnes passes to Mitchell. Up and over Hardaway. And it's Mitchell. The miss. This is why you want ball movement and player movement. And that's made it hard for the defense to key in on any one individual. They get it again. That's good by Thompson. Thompson. Not just a jump shooter, Thompson is also more than capable of converting inside. Outside Mitchell. Pass to Lynn. So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. It'll be on Zion Williamson. Good man. But the defender really went after him. Yeah, if you're going to foul, then make sure that you don't give a chance for the and one. Pool right side over Mitchell. It's off. And as we end the third quarter, a double digit deficit will make it tough to come back. 37. And it's time now to bring you our State Farm assist to the game. <laughs> yeah, just shredding the defense with that feed. Zero chance to stop that. Yeah, that's just a brilliant read of the defense. I mean, it was also excellent anticipation of the movement of his teammates before the pass. Just great harmony on all sides. Well, there may not be a lot of drama down the stretch as we head into the fourth quarter. Stranger things have happened. Rui Hachimura is out there with Clay Thompson. Then it's Josh Giddy. Then there's Kawhi Leonard. And it's Hardaway in a point. Outstanding dribble drive. And that replay was brought to you by Mobile One. Yeah, a double-digit deficit. They're going to have to play better. They need more of this kind of aggressive play. Thompson with the block. And with length and instincts, Thompson has been an elite defender in the lead for years. Outstanding distribution there. I mean, what impressive passing ability. Oh, it's stolen by Achimura. Right side Giddy. Leonard outside. Launches a three. Nails it from beyond the arc. And Boston leads by 19. And a closer look here at the hustle stats for Boston. You have to be a fan of the energy they played with on the defensive end. Active hands and feet. And it's come up big a few times for them. You know something else, guys? You know, they came out of that tunnel sprinting in a full stride sprint. That translated to the floor and lots of success in the fast break game. Poole, he's checked in for Boston. Lyles, he's checked in for Sacramento. Giddy against Fox. Fox double team. About a minute and a half into the fourth now. The shot no good. Oh, some solid defense from Poole. And at this point, they're loving this big lead. Absolutely. And they haven't really faced a lot of resistance. You can add another offensive rebound to the tally. Just one of the areas where they're taking them to the task. Offensive rebound. Hachimura in the post. Herder defending. Poole shot is off. And it's Sacramento's ball. 
Floats one up. Here's Herger. And there's a whistle. He'll head to the line to shoot two. And he makes a first. First team ball. He makes one or two that time. Pass to Poole. The three. And out of bounds. Sacramento will have it. The ball goes. Timeout call. Sacramento. Yeah, hoping to tap into something that'll get them clicking. Yeah, and you know, that's going to be the focus of this timeout. They need to come up with a spark to get the offense going. Man, your dance team. That was your new dance team. Make some noise. Fox with the ball. Outside Herder. Pass to Barnes. Beyond the arc. Sinks the tray. Barnes. Barnes has got five points in the quarter. You know, Barnes is a good shooter from deep. When he's in rhythm, he's dangerous from out there. And it's slammed in by Oxymura. Nice timing on these jumps. He's somewhat on the small side for a power forward, but he just never gives up. Fox outside. Elbow shot on the way. Yes, it's good. Yeah, I like it. I like it. Fox continues to get better from the mid-range just the way he wants to. And Boston calls time here. Yeah, Coach no doubt wants to use this timeout to review the matchups and maybe make some adjustments as well. And I agree. I think there's going to be a new wrinkle in their game plan when they come out of this timeout. All right, we present our New Balance player of the game, Jordan Poole. And he really made his presence felt on the inside. Just so active and looking all game long for openings. And he found them by scoring a lot of baskets by slashing to the hoop. <laughs> it's evident that this crowd loves him. And with the way he's playing, it's easy to see why. He's really delivered for them time and time again. A moment to hear from Allie LaForce. Hey guys, the head coach for Boston had some instruction for his guys during the break. And he implored them to be patient at the offensive end. He wants to use every second of the shot clock. He said, quote, if we take care of the ball, we take our time, and play D, this game is ours. Allie, thank you. 141 left to play in the fourth. 4-3. Four, Pass to Leonard. The three. Cool for three. The shot, no good. He's missing shot after shot after shot from long range. But time running low, he'd be better off trying something else. And Fox powers it home. How about the vertical from Fox? Throwing it down with authority. Go get it, young fella. They grab their own miss. Inside. The kick out to Poole. Jacks up a three. No good. So Sacramento will take it the other way. Here's Herder. And some very quick points for him on that possession. Unfortunately for them, they're still going to come up short. You wish they'd shown this kind of fight earlier. Yeah, you know, I agree with you. They waited too long to finally ramp themselves up. He buries it from three. Their focus has been terrific. They really put on a clinic here today. And, you know, everybody in the building knows this is a wrap, a done deal. Put this one in the W column. And he goes strong with the one-handed jam. And guys, that's got to be the dagger. This is how you finish a game. Yeah, what a time to put the hammer down. Any hope of a comeback diminished. And we've got 28 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Outside Herder. Shot clock at six. Pass to Sabonis. Lays it up and in off the pretty assist. Boy, you got to do a lot more than that to stop Sabonis now. I mean, he is used to overcoming aggressive defense. Here's Doliak. And down it goes. Jam that one home. An elite score, demonstrating once again how fast he can fill it up. And there's the call on Rui Achimura. That's his first foul. That's his first personal foul. Second team foul. Substitution on the court. Davis, the pass to Mitchell. 